Hi, friends welcome to my video tutorial on the Mac OS installation could not be installed on your computer. Before that don't miss to subscribe, like and share. Here on my Mac I am getting this error on installation and restart put Mac is in a loop. To fix it quite the installation, from top edge move cursor on a screen, to show up the menu icon, click on Mac OS installer and select quit Mac OS installer. From pop up Mac, you need to select a startup disk option not a restart option, because restart your Mac will start the installation process again and again, so go with the startup disk. Next, you have to select your Mac disk that you are working on it. Once you select it, go with the restart button option on the confirmation pop-up. Select restart and wait for the user login screen on your Mac. This restart process will take more than expected time. Because your Mac roll back all the process and change the boot drive without data loss if the solution is not worked for you can turn on your Mac after repair or reinstall Mac OS that explained is other solution in the last of this video tutorial. After login with your Mac, you need to enter the Apple ID password to set up iCloud data on Mac it will take a few time to restore old settings on Mac after installation completed later this follows on. Screen instructions for setup hey Siri and more. Now finally. You should check your Mac OS is updated or not. Go to the Apple logo on the Mac menu and click on System Preferences and find Software Update option. So, your Mac will show pending updates if available. Here's my Mac installed latest Mac OS but the problem is in the installation loop. In other solutions, we can save our Mac data and turn on normally as soon as possible. Restart your Mac, then press and hold Command and R key at once until you see the Mac OS utility window on the screen. The first option is to restore from Time Machine Backup, restore old data and OS on your Mac. This rollback process is really useful in many cases. The second solution is to reinstall Mac OS on your Mac. This process download and install new latest copy from the internet and install itself automatically. The last option is to repair your Mac drive, using the Disk Utility option. Go to this option and select the drive from the side panel. Now click on First Aid option from Tabs. Now select repair option and start repairing your drive here's my Mac that you can perform without data loss. I hope you guys this video is really helpful to you. So don't miss to subscribe to my channel and like, share to be more helpful to others. See you guys and let's you catch in the next video.